guys, Heather here from Tie-Dyed Iguana, and today we're going to learn how to tell if our bearded dragon is gravid and if she's getting ready to lay eggs. So we've got a couple of bearded dragons ourselves that are currently gravid, and we're going to show you some of the different ways that we can tell, and then we have one that's getting ready to lay her eggs, we think, like she's really close, and uh, yeah, we're just going to give you a few behaviors to look out for. Okay, so we're going to have our big female here sh uh, show you the different ways that you can tell that they're carrying eggs. These are some of the early signs to look out for. The first thing you'll notice is a rapid weight gain. They will get really plump, really fat, and you'll be able to feel the eggs in their belly. They'll kind of feel like little marbles rolling around in there and that makes them look very chunky. And as for the weight gain, you'll see that her belly is bigger down here by her back legs. She doesn't want me to really touch her. <laughs> so, and then you'll notice like little lumps and bumps in the belly. So from here, here's a better angle. You can kind of see how much her belly sticks out in the bottom, like closer to her back legs. So that's a good way to tell that she's gravid with all that rapid weight gain from all the eggs and stuff. And then during the early stages, they'll have an increased appetite because they're trying to build up all that fat and everything to, uh, to be able to lay the eggs without, uh, because they lose a lot of weight when they lay the eggs and they usually end up flat as pancakes. So they need a lot of fat reserves and stuff to make sure that they have enough energy and everything and resources to lay those eggs. So basically the three ways that you can tell is the rapid weight gain, the increase in appetite, and the ability to feel the eggs in their belly. All right, now this one is closer to laying her eggs than the other one. Now the first thing you'll notice in one that's uh, closer to laying her eggs is that they're very restless. Uh, she's been, uh, as you can clearly see, she's been uh, running around her tank. It's already been clean this morning, and there's already a whole bunch of uh, bedding in it. Uh, she's really hyper, restless. You'll notice them scratching at the glass of the tank, at the glass walls, and they're just really hyper and uncomfortable. And yeah, that, when they get close to laying those eggs, definitely get a lot more uh, restless. Then let's see, will you do the second behavior right now? It looks like you were doing it earlier. Uh, the second behavior to look out for is digging. They will dig up, uh, dig up corners of their tank. They'll dig up different spaces and they'll, they, <laughs> you can see that she dug all the way down to the glass bottom of the tank. So yeah, did you, did you dig today? Yeah? Yeah, you'll notice like, like all the bedding is piled up on this end so yeah she definitely dug that out last night and if you see something like this if you catch them digging and stuff that's a good sign that they're pretty close to laying because they're trying to dig a nest there now we caught her digging this is what the digging looks like Yeah, so she'll probably go in the nest box either tonight or tomorrow night for sure. Yeah. And then in a lot of beardies, you'll see a, an actual decrease in appetite once it gets closer to the time that they're going to lay their eggs. Um, you might throw crickets in there and they might have no interest in them whatsoever. Uh, once they start decreasing the appetite, that's when to kind of look out for all these other behaviors like the restlessness, the digging, and all that good stuff. Now in our other bearded dragon, you could mostly just feel the eggs. You could see a little bit of the bumps, but on ones that are super pregnant, like this one, like really like closer to laying, you can actually see the outline of the egg in through her skin. You can see them actually poking out. And that's also a great sign that she's close to laying. That's time for her to lay. You can see those bumps there. 
Now this one, she's more iffy about being touched when she's like this. Uh, if I try to hold her up to show you the underside, she's probably going to freak out on me. So I don't want to do that. I don't want to freak her out. And you can see how, how much her belly is sagging down here compared to the rest of her. Yeah, you can see the... Let's see the lump, lumpy bumps from here. <laughs> yeah, you can basically see each individual egg in her. So yeah, those are the four different ways to tell if your beardy is close to laying her eggs. You want to look out for uh, the restlessness, the digging, the appetite decrease, and being able to see the eggs through her skin. They'll poke out and everything. Okay guys, so that's it for today's video. I hope that kind of helped you determine maybe if you were wondering if your bearded dragon was gravid or not. Hopefully that helped. And that's something uh, to look out for in the future if you have a female beardy. Even if she isn't with a male, it, she can still uh, become gravid and have eggs and they'll just be infertile. So yeah, those are some good behaviors to look out for. Uh, good tells of a gravid bearded dragon. And we'll see you guys next time.